So here are some helpful tips for anyone using a CPAP or caring for someone who does. The CPAP, or Continuous Positive Airway Pressure Device, is a widely used device that can often be problematic to operate, clean, and maintain. It's used for people who have breathing problems, typically at night, which is commonly known as obstructive sleep apnea. It occurs when soft tissue in the back of your throat collapses and keeps you from breathing normally. How your face mask fits can affect the quality of your treatment. If the mask is too tight, you may get sores around your mouth and nose. If the mask fits loosely, air can leak out, causing your sleep to be disrupted. So if you have problems with a mask that's either too tight or too loose, try adjusting the strap that fits around your head. If you're anxious about wearing a mask for treatment, contact your healthcare provider. They may recommend additional supervised training or adjustment in the size or model of your device. Never secure the straps of the face mask too tightly on your face and never use tape to seal the mask to your face. And of course, keep your mask clean. It'll fit much better if it is. Be sure to clean the humidification chamber too, since bacteria could grow inside of it. And hang your hose up between uses, so all the condensed water vapor drains out and the hose can properly dry. Using detergents that contain conditioners or moisturizers to clean your face mask may cause residue buildup, so follow your manufacturer's recommendations in the labeling or package insert about the daily care and storage of your device. The CPAP's filters also need to be cleaned. Washable foam filters need to be cleaned as soon as you can see any discoloration. The filters may need to be cleaned or replaced frequently, even on a weekly basis, if you have a lot of pet hair, dust, smoke, or humidity in your home. Now, the CPAP is prescribed to deliver a certain amount of airflow into your body. This is called the pressure. Knowing how to operate and maintain your CPAP is essential, so always keep the following information available. The correct name of your device, the name of the manufacturer of your device, contact information for your healthcare provider or distributor of the device, and support systems in place for emergencies, like loss of power, battery failure, or malfunction.